push-ups today. I'm going to take the pressure off of you and I'm going to teach you how to do a push-up that is easy and not so bad to do and as you get stronger you can progress to the next level. I always say there's no rules in fitness in my gym if you perform everything properly and you focus on your movement so you don't get hurt. You do what your body allows you to do so that you can be fit. You don't have to do military push-ups off of your toes. We're going to get there, but I wanted you to see how I start my clients. We sit back into the, into the lower the legs and we place our hands on the floor so they're going to be underneath our shoulders. Take your knees back so they're underneath your hips. And all I want you to do is to look at the floor and just lower your head to the floor and back up. So you're just lowering your forehead and back up. Simple, simple, simple. You want to make it a little bit harder? Go a little bit further out. You can get your hips up in the air a little bit if you like. Take it down and come back up. You want to progress a little bit more. Now I'm going to have you take your feet off the ground. Not have your hips in the air, have them in alignment, like a plank, in line with your shoulder. And then we're going to take our nose to the floor and our hips and press through. Once you get stronger in there, you can place your feet on the floor, come up into the military push-up, look at the floor, and press through. Okay? So, take the pressure off of doing push-ups, do what you can do, do as many as you can do, doesn't matter how many. So the one thing I don't like about all of the plank challenges and the push-up challenges is that you wind up overtraining. And remember, when your body gets tired, you take the path of least resistance. Your body takes the path of least resistance to make it easier. And that's when you start to dip in the low back, drop the head towards the floor, and you lose form. I would rather you do two good ones, five good ones, than ten bad ones. So work on your form, work on your strength, do a few every other day. Don't do them every day, every second day, third day, and go from there. You can alternate with a squat, a plank, um, something with the abs, a split squat. There's so much you can do with body weight training. So take the pressure off. I am here to help you make fitness fun and easy and doable. I'll see you in the next video, which will be some abs.